One of the enhancements in Excel 2010 is a new feature known as Slicer. Slicer enhances Excel pivot table functionality by making it easier for pivot table users to apply filters. For example, in the pivot table currently shown on the screen, users can filter the data by clicking the drop down arrow next to region and choosing the region or regions to which the pivot table should be filtered. However, as currently shown on the screen, Excel 2010 Slicer function has been applied to create a much more graphical application of the filter. With Slicer applied, users simply click on the box containing the desired filter and the entire pivot table will be filtered to that criteria. Users may also hold down the control key to select multiple filters simultaneously. To add Slicer to a pivot table, begin by clicking anywhere in the pivot table. Next, from the Insert tab of the ribbon, click Slicer to open the Insert Slicers dialog box. Within the Insert Slicer dialog box, click on the filter or filters to be applied. In this case, we'll simply apply the filter for region and click OK. Finally, reposition and resize slicer to suit specific taste. Now slicer is ready to be used. Again, to apply a filter via slicer, simply click on the box containing the filter to be applied. Also see that as currently shown on the screen, multiple slicers may be in force at the same time. Upon upgrading to Excel 2010, be sure to check out Slicer, a great new way to filter pivot table data. On behalf of everyone at K2 Enterprises, thanks for taking time to watch this video tip. We hope you found the information to be helpful. For more information on the training courses we offer, please visit our website at www.k2e.com.